Oh, that's a big red. That's a good red. That's a good one. You need me to get the net? Yep, this is a netter. Well, on this episode of the Ginu Guy, me and Becky, y'all know her as B, we're heading to the creek. We're gonna go and uh, see if we can get some good fish. We haven't been in a, a couple of weeks and uh, we're gonna try to get on some big old redfish. So hopefully that'll happen today. We stopped by St. Augustine Paddle Sports and they hooked us up. We got five dozen muds, five dozen uh, shrimp and a dozen uh, little fingerling mullet. So we're gonna go see what we can do with that. We're gonna first do some dock hopping and see if uh, maybe we can get something on these docks and then we're gonna head deep in the creek. So let's stay tuned and see if we can get on them big old reds. Well, it's a keeper mangrove. Oh yeah. Let's see what we got here. Yeah. Yeah. Right at 10. So the first dock we stopped at produced a ton of mangroves and one rat red. So we did get five keepers in the boat for the mangroves. And we're gonna go ahead and see if we can go ahead and uh, limit out on these mangroves and uh, maybe get a few reds in the boat. So we're gonna see what happens. We're gonna hit a couple more docks before we go deep in the creek. I don't know about the net. He's, he's a big mangrove, maybe. Yep, sort of fighting that hard. He might just be a big mangrove. Oh, it's a red. It's not big enough though. That's a nice looking red. It's gotta go back, but there's two reds in the boat and eight million mangroves. So, see you later, sucker. Grow bigger. All right. Under the boat. Oh, what was this guy? Oh, and his little friend. Say hello to my little friend. Oh, okay. Hello, little friend. See you later, sucker. All right, it's Tony, the Ginu guy. I'm here out in uh, the special location that we can't tell you about. But me and B are out here, and it's mangrove day, apparently, because we are catching mangrove after mangrove. Becky caught a small red, but mangroves are out of control today. We got five dozen uh, muds, five dozen shrimp, and a dozen regular uh, little finger mullet. So there's plenty of mullet already out here. So I don't know if that's going to affect us biting the reds or what, if the reds are going to bite us but the mangroves sure as heck are. So we're out here reeling them in one after the other. So let's see if we can get one of them big old reds instead of just these little mangroves. So let's stay tuned and see if we can get on them big reds. So we're stopping at our last dock over on this row here that we like to fish. And we're gonna see if we can uh, get anything against this wall over here on these last docks. These have produced good redfish in the past, but lately it hasn't produced really big ones. So we're trying to see if this place will, will actually start producing some big reds. They uh, put some new docks in there and I think they cleaned out some of them oysters on the bottom. So it's not as good as it normally, or as it used to be. But we're trying to keep fishing it and see if it comes back. Another little red. Where's your big brother? Where's your daddy? See you later, sucker. That was a delayed see you later, sucker, but I got it. Well, we're 
all finished up at the docks. Caught several little rat reds and we've already got our limit on mangroves. So we got 10 mangroves in the box and that'll be good eating. I don't know if you've ever had mangrove snapper before, but some of the best fish out there. Yeah, they might be a little small, but you get little nuggets out of them. It's pretty good. So now we're gonna hit deep in the creek and we're gonna try our little spot way deep in the creek. It hasn't been raining a lot lately. So, and the water seems pretty clear for Moultrie Creek. And we're hoping that maybe we're gonna find some of them big reds in the far back creek. So let's see if they're gonna be there. That would oh, that's a big oh, red. That's a, that's a good red. That's a good one. We need me to get the, the yep, this is a netter. That's probably gonna be a netter. I better get my line in first. <laughs> I don't know, he's not, he's swimming his way now. I don't know. He might not be as big as I thought he was. He's a keeper, though. No, he's not as big as I thought. Is it red? It's a red. I I thought he was bigger. He's not, but he might be 18. Oh, he's not as big okay. as I thought. That's pretty big. Looks nice. We'll see. Is that a mud or a shrimp? Mud. I don't even have shrimp back here. Is he gonna be big enough? I hope so. Nope, not big enough. 16 and a half. There you we are. go. You guys stay right there. <laughs> <laughs> you stay right there. Keep video. <laughs> All right, hold on. I'm get the hook out. Yeah, that's a good one. Let me get my camera. Yeah. I'll put them on the thing so I don't lose them. Pretty good. We'll see what his size is. He's definitely over 18. So he's 20 something. He's 21. Awesome. 21. There you go. we catch Lady? oh it's a trout give me that get the net baby you have to catch it don't come, come loose off fifteen it's a keeper I think scaring something oh that's a that's something else it's a jack it looks like that's a jack they're fighters. Yeah, yeah, they're fighters. Oh, Come here, sucker. Got you a jack. Hey, jack. Yep. Yeah. Uh, uh, uh. Get ready for that. It's pretty big. Yeah, not bad. Becky got a jack. You don't know jack, sucker. Well, we're still fishing. I think it's like two o'clock. Hold on. There you go. 
we're still fishing it's like two o'clock and uh we've caught a ton of reds probably about 10 redfish one some in a keeper at 21 a bunch of were maxed out on mangroves caught trout caught jack caught all kind of stuff it's been a great day we're going through the bait like there's no tomorrow so we've got 11 dozen we had five dozen muds one dozen uh fingerling mullet and then uh five dozen shrimp and we we're about going through most of it so we are going through the bait but we are catching fish left and right so i don't know how much longer we're gonna make it because it's, we've been out here all day but man the fish are biting Still catching reds. Not big enough. It's probably the one that was just biting yours. Maybe. Oh, blue tail. It's a pretty guy. See you later, sucker. Another 16 inch redfish. See you later, sucker. So we limited out on our mangroves and we got one 21 inch red for dinner tonight. So it was a good day. We caught a ton of fish, obviously, a lot of non keepers. Here I'm using my new Bubba uh, fillet knife, the electric wireless fillet knife, and it goes through those mangroves and those redfish like they're, it's nothing. So if you don't have an electric fillet knife, I tell you what, especially if you're going through those small fish, it cuts your time down way low. So uh, it's a good investment. Thanks for watching The Ginu Guy.